everyone, I'm just going to do a quick video on my new teal hobo bee or chromatics teal lagoon hobo bee. Uh, such a fancy name with the rose gold hardware. Now this is my very first um, hobo bee. I actually have never bought one. I've been eyeing them up for a long, long time. But the first thing that drove me nuts was the, um, the strap. It was always attached and I had had it between before and it always got twisted when I, whenever I've, I pulled it out of the car and would put it on. So um, I, I had seen that later people had detached the strap and, um, you know, used a messenger strap instead, but it just was too much work for me. So I know recently they made the change to have the removable uh, seatbelt strap, um, which... I like a lot better, so um, I decided to take the plunge with this one. Now the fabric on the chromatics is very thin. I have a chrome back, uh, be right back, and uh, I love the fabric on that one. Um, so knowing that this one was gonna come and be a little bit more squishy and not as stiff, um, I was excited to see how it would work on the hobo bee. So I thought this is actually the time that I'm gonna do this. So I'm gonna quickly show what I have in here. Um, in the mommy pocket, and I won't go over all the features because I know there's been a million videos already. Um, and I should say that I've packed this for um, just going out either, you know, in this case it's more with my kids. But usually it's just hanging by the door uh, ready for when I have to head out. Um, so in the mommy pocket here, um, it, it starts off being really matchy-matchy and then it goes downhill quickly. Um, I, in my coin purse I just have... Um, a mask and if you're not watching this in 2020 um, well I'm sure everyone will remember this whole period wearing masks but I like to just have a cloth, cloth mask on me because I head out somewhere and then I forget that um, I uh, that I, I have to go somewhere where I need to have a mask with me so um, yeah I've just got that in there so I've just got that in one of the mesh pockets here on the other mesh pocket Again, look at the matchy-matchy of this. Um, I had an old Charcoal Roses coin purse, and I actually thought this would go really, really well together. So in here, I just have um, a couple Band-Aids and some Polysporin spray, and I will be putting hair elastics in here because I think they're almost as emergency as Band-Aids. Um, anyways, yeah, I just thought that looked really nicely, and I'm kind of wishing that I had a set uh, in Charcoal Roses to kind of go in this, but that's it. Um, the only other thing I have in here is some gum. Uh, even with mask wearing, I like to chew gum. Um, I don't have anything on the key leash and I don't have anything in this back zipper pocket because I find it kind of awkward to access with having to lift this thing up. So I won't have anything in there. So, um, so that's it for the mommy pocket. And I'll try doing up some of these zippers. Um, in the tech pocket here, it's nice and spacious. I would normally have my phone, but I'm using it for recording. Uh, on the side, I don't have anything in this uh, side bottle pocket, um, but on this one I have hand sanitizer just that I can easily grab as I'm going into a store because um, all the ones in the stores I find are so harsh on my skin. Um, in terms of the back pocket here where the change pad would go, I don't have anything. Um, I think I, it's so thin here, I don't think I'd really like anything that would stick out too much because it would probably dig in on my hip as I wear it. So I'll probably be leaving that one empty. So then getting onto the inside, it just kind of opens up, which is so great. Um, so I have my Erin Condren planner in there. Now I'd seen a few other videos where people were um, talking about putting their planners in there and you couldn't really zip it up. I'm not sure if the chromatics is bigger or different or I don't know what but I have a lot of stuff in here and I was still able to fit this in um, which I was really pleased about because I sometimes just like to go somewhere quiet and plan or if we're driving somewhere and I'm the passenger I can just pull that out so that's great um on top I have just a little fabric pouch that has a bunch of fabric masks for the kids I've got three of them so Got that on top. Uh, in the middle, this totally doesn't match, but I'm just getting ready for my Disney set, uh, Disney uh, um, Amour de Fleur um, pattern to be coming in a Hobo Bee, so this stuff is all ready to go. Plus, this normally sits in my Chrome Be Right Back, so. Um, in here, I just have a bunch of stuff for the kids, so. Um, I have a pouch here, just with some uh, other medical supplies, Kleenex, wipes, um, plastic bag, just a whole bunch of stuff, extra EpiPen for my son with allergies, so 
I just like to transfer that from bag to bag and then if I know the kids are with me, I've got pretty much anything I need for an emergency in there. Um, in this little uh, side pocket with the zipper, I just have a small set piece with some lip balms and lip glosses, nothing too exciting, hand cream. And then in this um, mesh pocket here, I don't have anything in the opposite two mesh pockets, but I have really old Be Rich. I tried changing to the new style of the Be Rich, but I find it doesn't hold as much. But I think I'm going to have to do some evaluation because this wallet is so huge and heavy. And I think I have to reevaluate and somehow see if I can incorporate my Be Charged into my life and make things a lot easier. Um, I think that's about it. I just have a tag in there. But uh, yeah, apart from my hand sanitizer at the side, that's it. So you'll see. I don't know if anyone has uh, regular Jujubees. I don't. But... It's very floppy. It doesn't really stand up on its own, but that's fine because I usually have so much stuff in it that it's going to be standing up anyways. So anyways, that's my quick video. I um, hope you enjoyed it and uh, that you have a wonderful day. Take care.